doing an action pose with a uh, twisted body posture. So if you have your pencils all set, we're going to uh, draw ourselves a figure and so what we're doing is it's something that you would see a ballerina do so we do with we start with the usual framework this is the this is the uh, the direction probably in which we the posture of the central torso will be laid out that is the lower the groin area let's say we'll put the shoulders like this so delts are right there and of course we have the collar the neck and the head here so let's put down something for now and of course we can always we can always change it so now there's some foreshortening in this and uh, we're going to play with a few different options so we're going to start off so the chest also being put at an angle because everything is crunched here now if you would like to check out other action poses we have several videos that focus on uh, different action poses and uh, I think they could be beneficial so please do check them out if you like so here's the hand now you could distance it if it's a white shouldered person bring it closer if it's somebody slender shouldered as I said that this pose could also work for a ballerina and so hands right around there we'll see what we can do with the hands in a second but there's the arms we do that or like this I mean it depends on how you would like to lay it out so putting so let's imagine that the the torso goes right there and there is the groin area abs somewhere here and they'll be hidden with this hand coming in the front and then to start off you're going to do this shin and calf the other leg and you could google images and you will probably find many contorted poses something even like I've seen something like this I'm pretty sure there is online but this is one source of reference if you would like to go about it and we are pleased to share this so now it's looking like a person and it's uh, what we're going to do is so let's say that the hand was just like laid out it would probably be somewhere along those lines and of course it all depends on how much we are stretching the arm and if you see that the the delt and the pack have to pretty much like line up it would be nice to f have them like flow and here's our foreshortening bit with the arm coming in the front and less actually since that hand we we're trying with the open hand here we could have this hand open as well and go somewhere along that line there's a thumb so we have to imagine that the knee is like raised up here 
we did say it's a twisted body pose so we have to put in some like twisty stuff and there's the crunched thigh going into the groin and the other thigh is pretty much like straightforward so there's the knee shin and calf and let's say that there's the foot so what we're going to do is play with a few different options and there can be there's so much that we can do with this so for instance right here we can place the head like that so the nose is here eyes ears mouth that's one thing we could play well that is blue it's uh, not really a standout color from the purple is it so we're going to use a green for this one and let's say that we bring the peck down a little bit the collarbone structure down bring the delt down like here and flatten the peck out and we have a sort of a flight action we could leave this hand here still bar we could go and stretch this guy out as well give the hand its own character and we would have that and it's still going to work without changing the composition in the legs or of course we could also straighten out like both legs and maybe go like that so perfect, well not perfect, but sort of a flying flying pose, we could do that. Or we can also, uh, try to grab a different color here, yeah the brown will do, so we can also do this. So with the same, without changing like too much, we could go and put out the hand like that into a fist. raise the delt again a little bit stretch it into the pack and with that same uh, level that we achieved here just do that and we could have again another action leaving the leg where it is and of course you could change the angle of the placement of the knee you could change that angle you could spread this leg out if we want well that's going to look a little uh, like a jumping sort of thing but again when it comes to like uh, pop culture illustrations there's no limit of what how we can use this so let's say that we use the uh, the, the the spread out hands with this leg posture and this knee risen so it's like a jump or like avoiding something or even like flight if you just give even in that pose if you just give the figure a cape it will look like the figure is like flying trying to like you know turn around and it makes for a really expressive uh, drawing uh, uh, illustration but we could also uh, have this guy look down like down and like the eyes going downward and that will like still work in any of those placements even if the hand is there or the hand is here and we can actually bear us a thought something else initially why not we try to highlight that aspect and see how this like really works so I'm going to go with the most out of the box one here so slightly like still like misplaced shoulders there so one higher than the other I mean it gives a little character to the drawing and it helps you like you know so the, so the app crunch will be essentially like that 
and every bit of other composition that will go in will be crunched towards here and more open toward here and we are going with that knee just trying to highlight things so this is not as messy and then uh, I like this actually so we're going to stick with the straight out leg and look at that that really works so if we just put in a cape lie right there behind him that's a cape um, person or you can make this into fist give him a weapon and you know make him nightwing like daredevil like spider-man like so very handy pose uh, please do try it out it's a lot of fun uh, we put out content pretty much every day, so please subscribe, keep in touch, uh, keep on watching, and have yourself a wonderful day.